And as I stared at this beautiful lady, I thought, why do you look like Ramona from Scott Pilgrim vs. The World? Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Coliseum. In the last episode, we're, we went through the Pyrite Cave, and I think we're about halfway through, and I found four item boxes. This is crazy, man. We got some zinc, we got some iron, we're getting all the drugs. No, don't do drugs, kids. They're bad for you. Just look at that guy that ate that one person's face off. But we got a nice um, boost for our Pokemon. And that's all we came here for, I'm guessing. Alright. Oh well. I guess it's good. I'll use them later. Or now. No, I'll use them later. Because I really just want to get this thing done with. I'm pretty sure you guys know this by now. I just want this to end. Are you looking for Duke King's Pokemon? Could it be beyond here, I wonder? Ugh, the foreshadowing. You say it, but I'm not sure about it. Mela. You know, I kind of wish her name was Mesa, so I could be like Black Mesa. I don't know. I don't play Half Life, but I know about it because I was playing uh, Portal One the other day. My first time playing it, by the way. And <laughs> I saw the whole Black Mesa thing. My friend once mentioned to me before about how they had like battling or something like that. So I just thought that was pretty nice to mention. Got me talking. Got me rolling in the deep. Ah. Uh, Freaking Adele. There's this one chick in my school who just started singing that in the middle of the class, and I just wanted to like smack her and be like, shut up, you're gonna get this song stuck in my head. Though, then again, can't be as bad as the one song I've had stuck in my head for the past few days. I think I've mentioned this on the previous episode. It's like, I'm not awake in the morning and I stepped outside and I took a deep breath and I got real high and I say, what's going on? <laughs> Oh jeez, that song just doesn't want to leave my mind. I can't get what's out of my mind because I'm not crying in bed. Oh, just stop it, Thomas. Stop it. Stop it. Stop. That song needs to get out of your mind. Focus on the game. Espeon killed a Pokemon. And Meditite is about to attack a Pokemon. He ruthlessly half murdered a Pokemon. This Pokemon is using a move on my Pokemon to lower the defense of my Pokemon. Because Pokemon, 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 Pokemon. Ugh. I've lost it. <laughs> I've clearly lost it. Ugh. This, this just goes on forever. These battles and... Ugh, I'm not even halfway through the game. I'm like barely at the beginning of the game. Oh, Espeon finally grew a level. That's good. Grow more levels! Where's that Pokemon? I'll never tell you. Who's that Pokemon? Oh, I keep yawning every single episode. Don't feel any sense of direction. I'm already having trouble getting around in this cave. Um, partially yes and partially no, and there's a cipher right here. Oh, now isn't this something? This is the new edge of the world. This is the edge of the world. Good of you to come here. Actually, I think another place we're going to see later on in the game would be the edge of the world. But Cipher Peon Seymon sent out Sveal and Lilip. Oh, Lilip. Cradilly is such a tank. Like, there's so many tank Pokemon. Even freaking Walrein is a tank. Like, Jesus. And again, I guess each game has to have its own fair share of genres that cross over to stuff. Not genres, um, types of Pokemon. Like, physical attacker, special attacker, special defense, regular defense, speedy attacker, slow attacker, strong, like, god, so many, so many different combinations. That's what makes Pokemon, that's what really makes Pokemon good. There's different combinations of Pokemon that you can use to put on your team to really just decimate your foes. Just like, you get support, you get set up, or you can just go straight on attack, you get speed, and de just beat upon late game sweepers, and just regular game sweepers. It's just fun. And, I, and this is why it bothers me, and people are like, oh, Pokemon's for kids. Like, no, it's not just for kids. Adults can get into it too, you just stop playing at like, generation one, hated all the other games, as they started to evolve them more, and make them much more interesting for um, audiences that are still growing to this day. Like, if any game has found a way to keep its audience from the past to the present, it would be Pokemon. Because it's just been going on for maybe 15, 16 years now. 
and then you just look at Pokemon, just it started off so basic and now it's gotten so complex. While you can still play it the basic way and still beat the game the basic way, you can still evolve further into the game, involve yourself further into the game through the more complex side of it. It's just, it's just so much you could do with it, but just people, they just resent Pokemon now because it's not first gen or second gen. Those people, they, those people really bother me. The ones that say that all the other Pokemon games are bad because, oh, it's nothing compared to the first game and the second game. Saying that the Pokemon look dumb. Well, no, they don't look dumb. They look much more complex now, and the reason why for that being is because the DS has the ability to create much more complicated pixel art than the, than the uh, very restricted uh, GB, the Game Boy. Because it's just like, when you look at the Game Boy, you could barely put as much, uh, like, more than... God knows how many pixels on a screen, while on the DS you have an, not unlimited, but you have a much stronger amount of what you can put on the actual um, cartridge and what you can actually show in pixels. Even some uh, basic Pokemon designs have changed, like Nine Tails as uh, Tails. Like you can see more um, the orange part of it. Grimer and Muck looks much much more detailed. Uh, there's probably many more that I'm leaving out, but yeah, Moltres, uh, his, his flames look much more beautiful. Same thing with Charizard, the flame on the tail, but still, oh, came with that Pokemon we're after. Oh no, what did you do to it? Oh, are you serious? Ah, forget this game, man. Jesus. Oh, oh, I went down here for nothing. What a waste of six minutes. Oh, well, at least I kept talking. Oh, jeez. Alright, let's go, Seth and Rui, and doing stuff over here. Battle this fucker. I need to score points with Mirror B, and my Wii sensor bar is going off like crazy. I keep forgetting to turn that thing off, because I have the wireless sensor bar. Low tad and swap loop. Alright. Oh, I wish there was a way to turn off animations. I mean, I could just make this game go by much, much quicker. Because it's like you've already seen all these animations, so I'd need to see them like 20,000 times over again. Ooh! Swablu! Ah! <laughs> Sorry! No! Oh, my controller's being stupid again. It's. Oh, I hate these GameStop brand controllers. I really, really do. Oh, sorry if you heard that. I'm just trying to get the analog stick to work because it keeps going down. I mean, I think I mentioned that in an earlier episode, but it's just I, I I hate it. I really hate these controllers. That's why I'm never buying a GameStop. Like even if the GameStop brand controller was one cent, I wouldn't buy it. I just wouldn't because it would not be worth it. But then again, if anybody's selling something for one cent, it's probably not worth it to begin with. But I'm saying if it had the quality of the one that I bought. For the, like, which was about $20, and it brought that quality over to that one cent one. Still a good controller, except it's just not that, not the best. There's better ones available right now. And now Espeon's asleep, which is freaking wonderful, by the way. Meditate, awaken your true abilities. <sighs> Espeon, you are sleeping. Why are you sleeping? Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. You must wake up, Espeon. Ow. Holy! Oh, jeez. I keep yawning. This is not good. Not good in the slightest. Oh, jeez. Oh, whatever. Let's try to catch that Swablu. I got enough freaking Pokeballs. Come on. Go snack ball. I've been having a pretty good run in catching Pokemon lately. <coughs> oh, I'm so sorry for that. Coughing in your ear like that. I am just not the professional one. Oh, no. Oh, jeez. Ah, oh, jeez. No. Meditate, why? What did you do to deserve this? You did nothing wrong. Oh, my controller. Oh, whatever. It's an Umbreon, I guess. Oh, I really 
hate this controller. Of all the times it had to flip out, it had to flip out during the freaking recording. Espeon, wake the fuck up! Oh my god. Espeon's not gonna wake up and everything's just gonna go to crap. It's gonna go to crapsville. Oh my god, 10 minutes in the episode and what happened? Nothing happened, that's what. Beldum flinched, why? Alright, I bit you. <laughs> Wake up! Thank you! Jeez, how could you be so tired? I was about to say, if confusion missed after we just woke up, I was gonna like smack something. Ooh, a crit! Ho! Oh, you sure made up for that sleep time. Alright, take a nap anytime you want, as long as you can get crits as soon as you wake up. Ooh, level 30. Oh, now I can confuse people. Oh, this will be fun. Uh, we snatch. Why do they have the contest, like, information on this? Like, in the Hoenn region, you have the contest, and even in Shinnow, they went to Sinnoh, but... Why do they have the contest information here? There's no Pokemon contest. Ah, uh, useless crit. There's no Pokemon contest in Colosseum, so... Why do they need to bring that information here? I mean, I guess if you wanted to build a contest Pokemon in here and bring it over to Hoenn region, but... Why build it here, not in Ruby or Sapphire or Emerald? Or Fire Red Leaf Green? Like, it doesn't make too much sense to me, but... That's alright. You ruined all my hopes of getting a promotion, Sob. Oh, Jesus. I don't like these areas. Oh, wow. Okay, dead end. And what's up here? Oh! Finally! I know where I'm supposed to go! Alright, great. Then what's over here? Nothing! Alright, well, let's work with our Pokemon here. Our, my Pokemon. They're mine! We're gonna be getting ourselves into a gruesome battle, so let's just heal everybody. Do I have a revive? Uh, Zinc raises special defense. Bam. Iron raises regular defense. Bam. Protein raises attack. Bam. And Carbos raises speed. Uh, bam. Alright, now do I have a revive? I have one revive. Oh! Thank the Lord. All right, come back to me, Metatite. Where's my super potion? Oh, stop going down now. All right, let's go. Let's do this. Let's battle. <laughs> Good thing I didn't have to cut this in the three episodes. I could cut it off right now, but why? Dun dun, bum ba dum, bum ba. Oh, it's the best song in the game. I'm gonna let you guys listen. Oh, this game is this song is great. Yeah, Woot, it's about time, darlings. I'm so frightfully tired of waiting for you. Stop the music! Oh, you kept me waiting for so long. I decided to work up a little perspiration. <laughs> oh, but my, my, you have been busy being naughty and messing up our plans. It was oh so close for everything to turn out just right, just the way we hoped. But I can salvage our plan by beating you, little man. And so, there's time for one last frantic dance before the grand finale. Let the music play! Yes, here we go. Cypher Admin Mirror B would like to battle. His team is filled with Ludicolos. The, his team is legitimately just a wall. And what makes his team so difficult is they love to do rain dance, and they have rain dish which heals them each turn when the rain when it's raining. And I believe every Ludicolo knows rain dance, so we're gonna be here for a while, guys. So just kick back, relax, and uh, I don't know, get some popcorn or something. <laughs> I like eating popcorn. I love popcorn. I really do. But let's focus on the game. Oh man, these Ludicolos, they're gonna be crazy. If this battle goes like any way that I wish it will go, and that it's looking that way right now, then that's great. If it doesn't oh here we go, here's the rain dance. Here we go, right now it's starting. Yeah, you know, on Pokemon Battle Revolution, I remember I saw a video of a guy who had a team of Ludicolos, and he beat a uh, all these Ubers. It was the coolest thing. 
Like, he even beat a Dialga. I was like, wow, how did he do that? He had a, a Flame Orb, and he had Fling, and he kept flinging it, and then he, uh, he Ludicolo also knew Thief, so he kept taking it back and just chucking it. It was, like, the greatest, uh, thing that he could ever learn. And then he also had Facade, so even though he was, uh, burned, his power was increased with the Facade because of, uh, the status effect. It was a really smart combination. Oh, no, Espeon. Bam. Oh, you're still a- no. Ah, he's still alive. Can you believe this? Salsa. <laughs> I love this song, man. Oh, jeez. And the song at SD Gale of Darkness is just as good. Like, I, oh, I just love it. I really do. I just love him. This guy is one of the coolest Pokemon characters ever created. Like, maybe even greater than N. Like, it's just, it's just, there's just something about him that I just find so entertaining. His song is beautiful. His team is annoying yet works. It's just I love it. I love it. I love him. And his des <laughs> his overall design and look is just oh, it's so comedical. But I I, I just love this game. This is one of the reasons why I love this game too. It's just cuz of this guy and his song. Oh. Ooh, let's be on good level 34. Special tag is 99, wow. And here we go, another Ludicolo. Though he does have one Pokemon that isn't a Ludicolo, which we shall see soon enough. Hopefully. <laughs> no, we will. I'm actually doing pretty well. Oh, uh, here we go, now we're getting into the, uh... Leech Seed stuff, ugh. I forgot about Leech Seed, and it's still raining. Oh, jeez. I'm just glad none of them have Swift Swim, those Ludicolos. Cause that'd be terrible. See, Rain Dish. Ugh! Hate it. Hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it. Confusion, get the hell out of here. It's probably not gonna kill you, but at least do half damage. Or not, okay? Oh no. Ah! I forgot they know Dive! God. Oh, this game is just... Not this game, just Mirror B. He's, a... He's an asshole. Oh, there's Metatite. He did well, Metatite. He did well. Uh, let's try South Swablu. Because I'm actually interested in the Swablu. I might use him. Never used a Swablu before. Or an Altaria. Well, then again, if I never used Swablu, it wouldn't make me think I used Altaria. Oh, he has rain dish while he was diving. Uh, his Pokemon. Uh, I guess we have to take out one at a time. Confusion. And then a shadow, ru shadow rush. Rush should take him out. This guy's diving. Ouch. Oh, not the Fury Swipes. Oh, really? Oh, god damn it. Great. Here goes Espeon. Oh, I should have put the Toxic on Umbreon. Or Swablu. Oh, and I can't teach him TMs because he's freaking heart closed off. Alright, let's do this. Leroy! <laughs> Did it kill it? Did it kill it? No! Why? Come on. That's not even fair. It's just, it's just mean. Yeah, I get confused. Have fun with that. I always thought that looked so cool. Come on, get hurt by confusion. No! No! Ah! Why? They never get hurt by confusion. I hate this. Oh, come on! Thanks for wasting a turn. Ugh. This, this, this is just this. Ugh, this is not gonna end. Yes, I know you're in hyper mode. Now I have to call your ass. Oh my god. This thing is just stall after stall after stall. 
but whatever. We're almost done. I can't wait till we are. Yeah, 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 whatever. Here's his other Pokemon that isn't a shadow. I mean, is a shadow Pokemon. <laughs> it is a pseudo Wudo. Pretty different Pokemon than the ones he has, but... Whatever. He has a pseudo Wudo. Originally a Pokemon you could only get in gold and silver. There was a way to get him into Hoenn and Kanto, which was by trading him over from this game. But, since, um... Since uh, em Pokemon Emerald had a pseudo -Wudo, pseudo Wudo in it, it made that kind of um, useless up into Emerald's release. Ha! That's right, get hurt by confusion. Shadow, sh yeah, Shadow Rush. Oh god, my S's. I really need to work on my S's. <laughs> oh no, Swablu! Oh jeez. Oh, that was just mean. And now the phone's going off. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, are you serious right now? I'm just gonna ignore the phone. I'm sorry if you hear it. This is just. Oh my god. I should have closed my door before I started recording. And it just won't stop. But, oh my god. Rain dish. I could use Surf, but I don't want to kill that sh pseudo Wudo. Ugh. If I happen to kill it, I actually don't really care too much. I could just get him later on. After the game is beaten. Oh, you evaded the attack. Umbreon is a boss. And Ludicolo is still alive, like a douchebag. Pseudo Wudo flinched, yay! No rock slide for you. Rain dish. Restored some HP. Alright then. Um, hmm. This is gonna be uh, difficult. Yeah, I didn't think it was very effective. Which it's not. But I'm gonna have to catch him sometime. I think I'm gonna do it after this. Because this battle has gone on long enough. Colo fucking fainted. No, he's still alive. Come on. Oh my god. This is just the longest battle that I have ever had in this game so far. Alright. It's probably not gonna get captured, but I can only hope. I've had a good run so far. Maybe I can get it? I don't think so, but maybe. Never know if you don't try. Ah! Yeah, ah! Exactly. I really want this Ludicolo to just faint already. Like, Crokinole, just, just, just kill it already, please. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, whatever, you're fine. Well, there's Ludicolo. There goes Ludicolo. Now all we have left is this, uh, this jerk. Ow, that rock slide is damaging. Umbreon can handle it, but like, ow, Crokinaw. Salsa. <laughs> Still love that. Now all I can do is bite and bite. Let's bite it. Arr, bite the tree. Bite a tree. Actually, not a tree. You're just a rock. You're a lie. The rock is 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 a lie. I'm sorry, I was playing too much Portal yesterday. I'm trying to beat the game yesterday. Didn't succeed. I got far, but I didn't succeed. And there goes Crokinole. That's wonderful. And useless raid animation. That's great. <sighs> oh god, Umbreon's all I have left? I didn't even realize. Oh god. I gotta capture this thing, like, right now. Go! Go! Get captured! 
Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, yes, finally. Jeez, finally beat near B. I can't keep up with the tempo. Oh, no, no. What a no, no. Oh, no, no. What a no, no. All right, whatever. There's no time to talk about this. We're just going to end it off right here, and I'll start off in the next episode. See you guys then.